Hey, fourth graders, it's exit ticket time. Uh, it's from lesson 23. So let's take a look at it. <clears throat> it says multiply and write the product as a mixed number. Draw a number line to support your answer. We don't have to do that. You can if you want, but you don't have to, okay? So you have eight times one half, so it's eight groups of one half. Down here it says seven copies of one fourth. It's basically, it's seven times one fourth, okay? And then 13 times one third, all right? So, uh, seeing what we learned yesterday, see if you can remember what, what to do here, and then we'll go from there, all right? So, you get about five minutes to do this, um, and then do your best. All right, teachers, pause now. All right, there is your five minutes. So, let's see how you did. All right, here we go. Eight times one half. Remember, that's eight groups of one half. What you could have done is written out one half eight times and added them all up. Or all I have to do is do eight times the numerator here. Eight times one is eight and realize I have eight halves. Then to switch it into a mixed number, I do two fits into eight how many times? Four times and there's none left over. So my answer is just four, okay? So eight halves would be four. Okay, so down here, seven copies of one fourth. I told you that copies of means groups of, okay? So seven groups of one fourth. So I, I wrote an arrow here because all I'm doing is multiplying the seven times that one, right? Seven times one is seven and we're dealing with fourths. So I have seven fourths and I have to change it to a mixed number. So four goes into seven, one full time. There's three left over and fourths is my unit. So one and three fourths. And then finally down here, I rewrote it so we could see it a little bit better. So 13 times one third. So I just multiply that 13 times the numerator here. 13 times one gives me 13 thirds. If I counted one third 13 times, I get 13 thirds, right? So three fits into 13, four full times with one left over, and we have my three as our thirds, as our uh, denominator, okay? So there's that for you, okay. So we'll be, uh, hang tight, be right back with our I can statement.